Here is how you retrieve your API credentials to connect your website to your WooCommerce site store. So here we go. I'm going to go to account settings off the profile. Then I'm going to go to here to API access. I'm going to click update. I'm going to scroll down to this one right here. NVP SOAP API classic. Manage API credentials. Then it's going to send me a text message. There it is. And here are the credentials. So here's one. I'm going to copy that and I'm going to put these into a notepad for now. There's another one. And here is another one. Okay, once I'm done with that, I'll go ahead and click the done button. And now I'm going to jump over to my back office. And I'm going to go to WooCommerce and then settings. Chance to update here. I got a lot of windows open. Okay, we're going to go to Payments tab right here. And we're going to go down here to PayPal Standard, turn it on, set up. Okay, now here's my email. Here's my email again. I'm going to go ahead and put Live API Username right here. Oh, that's not the username though. I messed up. So my username is right here. Live API password and signature. Okay. And then once that's done, I can come back in here. I can go back here to account settings in my PayPal account. And I need to get pay payment preferences. Oh, wait, uh, website payments right here is where I want to go. Okay, we got API access, website preferences. Click update on this. I'm going to turn this on for the auto return so it goes back to the site. And I'm going to put mydomain.com. And I'm going to click save. Then I'm going to come out here and I'm going to turn on payment data transfer. It's going to give me this long string of code right here. Go ahead and copy that. And then I'm going to paste that right into here. Payment identity token. That's where that goes. Now that I'm done with that, click my save button.